long enough. Let me give you the grand tour before we embark. My, My baby! First stop, the, the heart and soul of this I've yet to meet a problem that can't be solved with explosives. And speaking of explosives... the right idea, Captain? Did she give up? Or did she move on? It's all a matter of perspective, I suppose. <laughs> Excited, Captain. I know how your speeches can get people riled up. <laughs> Captain, why does it seem familiar? And so our intrepid captain falls headlong into the spiraling chaos of dimensional calamity, heralding the beginning of the end. My goodness, what an adventure. I swear, this story never ceases to amaze me. By the way, it's good to see you again. Or for the first time, depending on your past choices. Either way, I'm sure we'll meet again for the first time in the very near future and or somewhat distant past. Should this not prove to be the end of all reality, which it almost certainly is, it would be my great pleasure to guide you through my own universe, should the opportunity arise. Which doesn't seem likely to happen at this juncture, but when thinking in infinites, unlikely is just certainty waiting for its turn. What's wrong, sport? Oh, bless my stars. Was it the nightmare about the spaceship again? <laughs> that one just keeps coming back, doesn't it? Well, I know just the thing that's gonna cure that. Another story! All right, well, let's see what we got here. Uh, maybe a little too grisly. Uh, read that one too many times. Nah, not in the mood. Uh, not today. Why don't you decide, huh? You could read uh, a nice romance story, that'd be fun, or uh, a horror story. I know how much you love scary stories, but it might give you a few more nightmares, so you could go romance. 
It'll be a little silly and more than a little sappy, but it might be just the thing to kick you right back to sleep. Well, whatever you choose, I can guarantee it's gonna come with a big ol' hug, free of charge. 